Welcome to Go on Shaw TV. I'm Jenna Hamilton. On this episode of Go, we'll meet the mother of a five-year-old little girl who's doing something extraordinary for cancer. Also on this episode of Go, the Junior Oil Barons are on the hunt for a provincial championship. But first, Craig Momney shows us there's more to basketball than just shooting three-pointers. Welcome back to Go on Shaw TV. With us today is Vonda, and oh, your yeah. daughter is doing something amazing. Could you explain it a bit? Yes, so Chandra Lily um, is five years old, and we have um, a few <laughs> friends who um, have been going through um, cancer treatment. So we decided that we were going to um, cut her hair so she, someone could get a wig, and you know, along that, try to get donations to um, help with costs that um, so you know, to give to cancer.ca. And she, within a month, we started on um, February 4th, which was Cancer Awareness Day. And up to now, she's tripled her initial goal, which was 500. She's up to nearly $1,500 for it. So that's remarkable. Wow, and did it come from a personal reason? Um, well, in our... Um, community we believe in SIVA which is serving our community and so at home that's what what I try to teach her is and th so this was her first big um, initial you know thing to you know serve her community to learn how to serve her community and um, you know we she agreed to it like I talked to her about it I you know I showed her how um, chemotherapy makes people lose their hair we looked at pictures of people going through chemotherapy and before and after you know so because I wanted it to be her decision that you know she understood that she was going to cut her hair and she was going to help somebody you know feel better about themselves how did she initially react to it um, well, she's pretty easygoing, as you could tell, <laughs> and um, so sh she listened, she asked questions, and she agreed to it, you know. Um, you know, sometimes there's a little bit back and forth. Um, she doesn't understand it completely, she's five, but um, I think she, she is excited to help. She likes helping people, so, yeah. That's great. Are you excited to cut your hair? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, but you look so nice. <laughs> but first, the Junior Oil Barons are getting ready for their Provincial Pee Wee Hockey Championship. Welcome back to Go on Shaw TV. With me now is Vi Stag. And could you just tell us a little bit about your personal story with Vonda and with cancer? Yeah, sure. I met uh, Vonda at the hospital while I was having surgery, um, my first surgery. Um, then I ended up going to Edmonton for my second surgery uh, for colon rectal cancer. Um, that was just seven weeks ago. And so I had everything removed and I'm currently cancer free, waiting to find out if I have chemo, but time will tell. Um, other than that, everything is going good with me. That's awesome that you're cancer free. And how do you feel about Vonda and Chandra Lee doing this? Amazing. And I also last year donated 12 inches of my hair for cancer. Um, I didn't do any fundraising at the time. I wasn't sure about it. Uh, but after that, I had a friend whose daughter had cancer. So I um, know what it's like to be out of town and not have funds. And I mean, I guess I had funds. I have a husband who's working, but she was a single mom. So I made a Caterpillar 797 quilt, which is a big hit in Fort McMurray because all the guys drive these big trucks. So I made a quilt and sold tickets on it, and I raised $4,600 for her. Wow, that's amazing. That's my donation back to the community, I guess. Yeah, and this community is just one that just keeps giving. Oh, for sure. Everybody here is very, very giving. That's awesome. Thanks so much for being on the show today. Thank you. But right now, we're going to take a break. You're watching Go on Shaw TV. Well, that's all the time we have for this episode of Go on Shaw TV. If you'd like to donate to cancer research, you can follow the link on the bottom of your screen. I'm Jenna Hamilton, and we'll see you next time.